Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. Last time we completed our father's errands. And this time, well, let's go give Teresa some nails. Here are those nails you wanted. Thanks. Oops. So, how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering, will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Maybe we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. That sword is truly beautiful. It is a beautiful sword. Oh, Henry. Fine lass, eh? Now, stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. You haven't lost your skill, though. Would you like to try it? Sir, what good is a sword to a Let commoner? try it. You still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work, very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. They certainly will. They certainly will? Oh, okay. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. It's been an honor, say it's fun. Have a safe journey to Sapphire. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. A long, peculiar history. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green and the forge. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in scallets, here beneath the linden tree and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them or beat them? Meet. You have to keep going on about it. <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. Yeah. Yeah. A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened?
guys are here. Listen to me, Al. Listen carefully. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry! And what about you? Follow right behind. I'll go with you. No. You do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sarazi. If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me. Yeah, who has no idea how to sword fight? No fight. Sort of one day, sir. That only wasn't to begin with. Achievement unlocked. You completed the first quest. Run away! Cubans settled down right around this time in the Hungarian area, which makes perfect sense. Especially if you like historical games like Europa, you'll understand what I'm talking about. L l l uh, read about the uh, Battle of Varn. Oh. Uh, and that would explain a lot to you. Ow, ow, I can't see. I screwed that up, but also if you're a fan of like Age of Empires 2 as well, they talk about the Cubans a lot, they're, 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 I think they're one of the newest race, uh, races, civilizations in uh, the Definitive Edition. I 
Alright, let's try this again. There is no way we can fight humans. So we're going to do the smart thing and run. It's this west, right? You pigs! Don't touch me or I'll kill you! Go to hell, you turtle beast! Me know your bombard goods are not. you fool so like I said this game is very difficult at first and heck actually it stays difficult the whole time and um, that's the reason why I didn't play hardcore because why would I want to die once I would have already died twice had to restart you know alright let's try this again and do it right this time There we go, we should be okay now. Get away from the humans. Saving content, you're screwed. Wait, wrong game. on horseback. to the left along the stream. Run, everybody! The British are coming! Run for it! Close people are by the uh, sword crossing. You do have to be careful because they are literally right behind you. They'll kill you all. Yeah. Ow. 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 
Someone give him a drink and bring hot wine and bandages. Tell me, boy, who are you and where are you from? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They burned it to the ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe Tartars? Tartars, you say? Yeah. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. Grit your teeth, boy. I'm gonna pull that hair out. That's the appropriate reaction, just pass out. That's what I would do. Easy. All done. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you stand? There you go. As good as new. Thank you. If you idlers nothing better to do, get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage? Sir, this is a survivor from... I heard, Robard. Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you see the insides of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? Sir, um, I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. And the ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a, a strange language. They burned Scalitz to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. It said they came to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Sacking Gutenberg must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Scalos is a small castle, sir. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. Indeed, Sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. Do you think we're next in line? Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry. 
son of the Scarlet's blacksmith. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you for risking your neck to warn us. Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. As you command, sir. That's kind of suck when, when I suck on both versions. Okay, anytime now, gang. Okay? Holy cow. We're supposed to be doing an outro here. Alright. Guys, next time on Kingdom Come Deliverance. We'll talk to Sir Robot and see what we can do to help the castle. I'll see you then.